this is an update to my system for solar. I've now managed to actually uh, get my solar plugged into the grid at long last. Uh, this is the actual what I've done. As you can see, I've taken all the uh, equipment off. As you can see, all my all my bits and pieces are all laying around here near the batteries. Batteries have been disconnected uh, simply because uh, basically I want to get this on the grid. I've actually bought one of these. Can you see that? Uh, which is now on the board. Uh, as you can see on the board, it's a simplified at the minute. Yes, the actual uh, wires from the solar panels are coming in and they're screwed onto the board securely. Uh, but I'm going to put some proper connectors on them shortly. They're well, insul well out insulated from each other. They ain't going to go anywhere. On the right hand side, the bottom, I've actually, I've actually got a isolator for the solar coming in. Uh, on the top right. This controls the uh, the actuators on the solar panel uh, actuators, which makes it go up and down. So it has 12 volt power to the to a circuit used by Dwayne uh, Johnson in in America. Uh, he he sells the circuits which actually make them move up and down and left and right. They control them automatically. Uh, I've got an amp meter still in there because I've got a hole in the board. I might actually put that in line possibly because I've no load it to it. I've got a lower amperage one now in there so which I can put in line and as you can see there's the master volt solid in 600 controller which I managed to snatch off someone off eBay for uh, 200 quid which is about the right price I want to pay for them uh, as you can see today was a pretty quiet day but it's flashing away this is with four Kyocera 130 watt panels Run at about 60 to 65 volts, which probably is about right. Higher voltage doesn't always equal higher power, so it's all about amperage and, and amps and watts and volts. <clears throat> but as you can see, it's happily sitting there on the board. Uh, this is just a quick update to show you that I'm actually sort of bringing this up to the spec I wanted to. I still like the uh, the battery centre ideas. Uh, I'd still like to incorporate it into the system, and I will later on. I'm, I'm not going to sell the batteries, as I figure we could probably get about 500 quid in scrap for just the lead in them. I've got enough of them. I've got 32 of them. Uh, the power for the actual uh, the uh, actuators that move the satellites uh, is is basically uh, I'm using two of the batteries of this bank of 24 at the minute. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a power supply on the board, a 12 volt regulated one that will run the actuators. So I should probably think. Probably a 5 amp little power supply would probably do it. Uh, I, need, I need regulated 12 volt. Uh, if anyone's interested, I've got a dump load for sale, possibly. And I've also got a Zentex uh, C40 or 60, I can't remember. That's the uh, 1224 volt one, I think you find. And also got a, a uh, trimetric meter, which might be up for grabs if anybody wants one. Uh, they cut, I got mine from Canada because I couldn't get it in the UK. That's a, that's a battery bank meter display and that's, that's really good. Uh, what I actually will do quickly, I'll just quickly compare all this clutter. Uh, if I, can do it, I might have to edit this out, I don't know. We have the capabilities now. <coughs> uh, I'm waiting for, the, for a couple of Duane's circuit boards to come back from the repairer. Uh, as you can see, this is my uh, setup. You can see from there I've got actuators, one going up and down, one going left and right. Uh, at the moment it's uh, it's got a single one in, the, in there at the minute, in, in that little box, but I'm going to redesign the box. Uh, the fact remains about this, if you, if you face the sun you get more power. Okay, and as, uh, as Dwayne has told me on the phone in America, in the summer you gain 50% by moving uh, and in the winter you gain 100% so basically you get a, I think that's, is that right, you get a you get a third more during the summer and you get half more in the winter so uh, anyway this is a little update, then see my cables are not the neatest but <coughs> it fully works uh, I'd like to build a bigger one. I'd, I'd actually build one with about 4K of stuff on it, but that would be a serious uh, build. Okay, hope you like this. Uh, any comments? Throw them at me. Alright, bye.